If you thought stealing Sheldon Cooper's seat was dangerous, well, at least he didn't stab someone in the neck over it. Unlike a certain Dallas Cowboy. It was 1998 in the Dallas Cowboys training camp. They already had three Super Bowls in the decade, but their time was coming to an end. Offensive lineman Everett McIver was having a haircut, but didn't know he took superstar Michael Irving's seat. Irving was one of the greatest receivers ever and had seniority over McIver. The Hall of Fame were shouting at McIver to get out of his chair, but the big man didn't budge, and he got some vocal support from the other old linemen. McIver shoved Irving, and the two brawled. Next thing you know, Irving got his hands on a pair of scissors and stabbed McIver in the neck. Thankfully, it wasn't as fatal, and the man still got to play. They settled the matter eternally, and Irving paid McIver a fine. But sheesh, I'm never taking someone's seat again.